Hello beautiful and magnificent beings. How are you? Thank you so much for joining me today. It is such an honor, a blessing, and a privilege to be your Reiki practitioner. This session is all about nurturing, feeling loved and supported. Things are so crazy out in the world and can seem out of control. And then we have our own personal lives, our own business to deal with as well. So I'm going to help you feel safe, calmer, relaxed, more at peace, satiated, giving you exactly what you need, helping you to have more clarity and just pull your attention, pull your energy back into yourself so that you can better focus and go back out into the world to do your best, to feel amazing and not be stressed and worried about things. Of course, this is just natural for humans, but I want this session to help you become more aware when it starts to happen so you can hopefully not get caught up and get sucked in, which is so easy for us to get distracted and overwhelm sets in. So welcoming the presence of all that is, Reiki masters, ascended masters, spirit and animal guides, benevolent beings of the highest truth and compassion, deities, saints, ancestors, in welcoming this divine energy and support to realign and reestablish our base energy, our stability. So I'm working with rose quartz and rhodochrosite. Just surrendering to the ancient and sacred Reiki, the divine spirit of love, allowing precognition. Allowing us to be more awakened and in the moment. Attention to what's going on around us from our guides, especially when we feel that pull of distraction. Allowing to be more when seeing and feeling the signs, the synchronicities, the numbers, all the support that we're constantly receiving that we often miss. Being aware of that, letting go of the distract, coming back into the present moment, standing strong in our power, our conviction, to reestablish boundaries, to love and support ourselves the physical, the mental, the emotional body, the light body, the spiritual body. We have so much love and support around us, even in times when we don't feel like it, that's when it's most important to moment, to breathe, to allow, to center, asking our guides for a sign, Sometimes we see it, sometimes we just feel it, sometimes we know. That's the beauty of our clairs, trusting that divine instinct. Also working with yellow jade, feeling the joy and the positivity in life. 
Sure, things can be overwhelming and might seem out of control, but always remember there's as much good as there is the opposite of what you think that is. Allowing that joy to fill up. Connecting with the sun, allowing that energy to be a strength in our day-to-day -day lives. Feeling that energy in the solar plus reverberating, filling up our body, remind our strength. Working with Picasso Jasper for creativity, helping us to be more open and understanding to creative ways problem solving, becoming more creative, how we handle ourselves, our day-to-day -day lives, allowing that spontaneity and trusting, Coming up with creative ways to use your power to redirect, to support you and your surroundings for those you love and care about when you are needed for support. Remembering you are a bright, shiny light in this world. And you do not have to allow your energy or your light to be dimmed. If you feel you're losing that sparkle, again, just taking a moment, placing your hand on your heart, coming into the moment, opening that channel, allowing that divine, sacred light connection to lift us back up. A gentle breath in and slowly out, closing out the session. What inner peace message would you like us to know? What would you like to reveal? What should we focus on? What should be we what should we be more open to? Let me see if I can read this without my glasses. Take responsibility <clears throat> for your life as a creative adventure. We were just talking about creativity, which is probably why I was so drawn to the Picasso's slab. <clears throat> Take responsibility for your life as a creative as a creative adventure. How can you live with more meaning, integrity, and truth? Perfect message. Very inspiring. And this is something you can use when you start to feel a little off centering, calming, look at her face, how serene, she's out in nature, she's taking a moment, she's connecting, she's asking these questions and turning it more into a creative adventure. Thank you so much for joining me today, everyone. I hope you enjoyed this session, you everything you needed. Remember, sometimes you need more than one session at a time. Thank you for your support for your heartfelt comments, wishes, and blessings, for your donations and your gifts. I appreciate you so much. And until my next video, there is so much love for you here. Highest blessings and infinite gratitude. Satnam.